here's how to beat greedier mode as the lost go into the shop and look for the d20 or the d infinity if you see neither of them re-roll with the eternal d6 if you don't get either then reset all right here we go we finally got the d infinity all right it took a few tries i almost pressed l2 to reset by accident i play on controller all right so what we do is we have to play through this floor and buy that d infinity all right time for the boss I'm gonna just do one boss at a time, so I'm gonna press on the button so the other one doesn't spawn. Because my damage sucks right now, and I can't I can't fight two bosses with this kind of damage. So we have enough after the first boss fight to go ahead and buy the D Infinity. We take that, and of course, the D20 shows up right after. Okay, bro. Alright, the bosses are down. No need to press the devil button because we're gonna get every item we want already. So I don't even need to risk fighting that boss. Ah, oh, great. This room could definitely be the end of me, bro. Yo, why would they give me two fat spiders in this room, bro? Come catch me here, stupid. Go on down to the next floor. We need a battery in this store. That's a bars. I just realized that. I'm spitting bars? Oh, snap. And we do not get a battery. We can try to reroll for one, which is exactly what we're going to do. I've been trying to do this forever, and they don't want to give me a battery. So hopefully I can get one this time around. Just give me the battery, bro. There it is. Finally. Okay, this is great news. All I have to do is make it through this floor, and we're good. I want to save my five cents, but I'm going to buy the key just because my stats are so bad. I need something to help out. And Ghost Pepper will definitely help out with survivability on this floor. Wow, that's crazy. And we have some gaps to fly over. We should be good. All right, I'm going to fight the boss without picking up any of these coins. It's risky, but I'm going to do it because I have Ghost Pepper. So I'm going to just press. Oh, my gosh. All right, that's really bad. That's really bad. No, I got to press the button. If I don't press this button... I'm done. Okay, good. We press the button. We should be good here because we have flying. All right, reset the holy mantle. Boom. Fight the next boss. All right, she's down or they're down. I'm going to press the button in the middle because this room is about to get very packed and it's going to get pressed eventually with all the consumables that are going to be on the floor. So let's prove this is not good. This is really bad. Oh my gosh, that was so stressful. That was so stressful. I'm not walking in there because that could be a Krampus fight. I'm not even going to risk it, bro. So we have a battery in here, which is good. We picked up a couple coins by accident, but it's okay. We're going to re-roll this with the D20. Boom. All right. We do it once. We have a battery to do it again. I'm going to pick up the dime because it is going to help us buy another battery. And just open up all the chests that you see. If you get a justice card, pop it because those are more consumables for you to re-roll. Don't pick up any of this stuff. It all has to get re-rolled buy another battery re-roll this stuff boom buy another battery and you get the point you're going for a golden key once you get a golden key it's basically gg and more batteries of course i accidentally used the d100 but it worked out here because i re-rolled into mom's key which really is good for this build that was actually luck and you get the point you continue this until you start to get some really good items and a lot of money whenever you see a nickel or a dime you pick it up the other coins you leave alone until things start to get really hectic. It's kind of getting a little bit crazy already and I can barely move through here. If you pick up things by accident, it's not that big of a deal. Just don't pick up too much because then you're not going to have that much to reroll. So I'm going to stick with the cancer trinket and the wooden cross because we don't need any more damage. Here we are in the fight. He should die pretty fast. Let's do this. can't even see anything that's happening on the screen this could i could actually lose this just because i can't see anything or or maybe not we win just like that easily <laughs> that's how you do it fellas